queen of carnival has been keeping her reign a secret for months and is excited to finally let the cat out of the bag. WDSU anchor Randy Russo sits down with this young adventurer about her family's deep-rooted history with the Rex organization. Charlotte Laney Langenstein is a bit of a thrill seeker, from skydiving to water rafting and spending her summers in South Africa. We'd go diving, there'd be sharks left and right, and there was never really any fear with that. And I think I just got this huge adrenaline rush from it, and I kept going with that in life. That next big adventure? Reigning as Queen of Carnival 2015. Definitely a different type of adventure, but it's been equally as thrilling. Uh, definitely getting my heart racing left and right. And a be even more so come Tuesday, but it's been a great ride. And a ride that many of Lainey's family members took before her, including her grandmother Dolly, who reigned as Queen of Rex in 1949. My grandmother passed away when I was very young, and it's been a very good connection with her, and I feel like I'm getting to have her back in my life a little bit through it all. It's just been great. Lainey's gown echoes that bond. The chevron design on her dress mimics the one her grandmother had when she was queen, and the linear beading is similar to that on her grandmother's mantle. What do you think about the finished product and having so much of her family history embedded in the dress? Surely couldn't ask for anything more. I mean, it looks like something that could be in a museum. Lainey is currently a student at Vanderbilt University and an Isidore Newman grad. Growing up, Mardi Gras was an integral part of her life at home, as was the Rex organization. I loved Mardi Gras because I would get to go see my dad riding on a horse as a lieutenant for Rex, and I would look forward to that every year. He'd ride up, and I'd kind of get on the horse with him a lot of the time. Sometimes if I was lucky, he'd do a loop with me. So as Lainey trades in riding horses and elephants to being a part of the biggest ride of Mardi Gras, she hopes carnival goers take the time to soak in everything the holiday and city of New Orleans have to offer. Truly, Mardi Gras is such a great magic to it. I think that it brings everybody together and brings the whole city together, people that would normally not be united. And I just want everyone to feel that. So go out there and share some beads with everybody and uh, have a great, great day. On your side, I'm Randy Russo, WDSU News. In addition to her grandmother, the Queen's stepfather was Rex back in 1991. Her brother served as a Duke last year, and her mother, a maid back in the 1970s. You can see the new King and Queen of Carnival role in the crew's 134th parade on Fat Tuesday.